It's election time, and that means two things. Number one, TV commercials have become so annoying you'd rather use a sledgehammer than a remote control on your Samsung. And number two, it's time to bring back the malarkey meter. The first ad we're tackling is this video spot produced by the NRA. It shows a woman and child getting robbed and presumably attacked, maybe even killed. It happens like that. All because why? Because, quote, Charlie Crist has opposed your gun rights. So is that true? No, it's not even close. In fact, Charlie Crist's record on guns is so pro-gun rights that he receives solid A ratings from who else? The NRA, the very group that's now attacking him in this ad. But back then, Crist was a Republican. So to recap, Charlie Crist is a Republican, an A-plus candidate from the NRA. Charlie Crist is a Democrat, a guy who wants women and children killed in their houses. Now, Crist has expressed concerns about high-capacity magazines, but nothing about taking anyone's guns away from them. So this highly inflammatory and misleading ad rank says, Major Malarkey. Next, we have this mailer from the Florida Democratic Party that goes after Republican legislative candidate Bob Cortez. In the ad, the Democrats found a lady who's quoted as saying, quote, Bob Cortez's tax plan means we pay more and I can't afford it. So what's wrong with this quote? It's pure fiction. I tracked down this Linda, her real name's Linda Manzanelli of Winter Park, and she said she never even said such a thing. The whole quote was simply manufactured. Is that what we're doing now? We're just making things up? Because if we are, uh, I'd like to introduce you to Kate. And Kate said, Scott Maxwell is, quote, the hunkiest Metro columnist south of the Mason-Dixon line. <laughs> Come on, that's just bogus. Plus, the even so-called Cortez tax plan is pretty much non-existent as well, with the small print blaming Cortez for votes that other legislators took years ago. Manzanelli said she still likes Democrat Karen Castor Dental, whom the Democrats were trying to help with this ad, but she had no use for this negative mailer, and neither do I. Not just because it's negative, but because it's wrong on the facts, and that's the only thing the malarkey meter cares about. So this one also rates a major malarkey. We'll get to more ads down the road, but until then, I'm Scott Maxwell.